Someone is crying to God because of your kingdom spouse. Someone is crying to God because of your kingdom spouse. Shalom, the Lord bless you. Welcome to Peppers and Marita Bliss with Pastor Honorine. I have a word to share with someone. Sometimes the things, the mistakes we make in the past come chasing after us. Sometimes the mistakes we make in the past come chasing after us. And for instance, you have a child with someone and you deny to take responsibility for it. And they are struggling with that child and they are trying to raise them all by themselves. It doesn't matter whether the relationship failed or not. You should take responsibility. The mistakes you did in the past sometimes come after you. Sometimes someone is crying in pain somewhere because of what you did to them. You can't just move on like nothing happened. You've got to learn how to confront your past, how to fix it, and not just move on like someone who defecated in the bush. You can't just get up and move on like you did nothing. Yes, you are remorseful about it. Yes, you feel bad. Now you know better. You are more mature. But sometimes, because someone somewhere is crying, you've got to go back and fix it. And if such a person is in your life and you know they hurt someone yesterday and they've not fixed it, you, 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 you maybe you betrayed your business partner and and you took what rightfully belonged to them and you've not fixed it how do you then think god will bless you how do you think you move on as if nothing ever happened some of the problems we are facing are as a result of the mistakes we made in the past some of the problems the cases that are following us are a result of the mistakes we made in the past the thing is we might not choose, we, 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 we act the way we decided to act. But when it comes to the consequences, we don't have control over them. Go back and fix what needs to, to be fixed. Or your kingdom spouse has got to go back and fix what needs to be fixed. Hallelujah. God bless you. Shalom.